What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Where the Local Skate. I'm your host once again, OG Skate Show. This is a podcast where we get to know local skaters on and off the board. And today we have another local skater in the house. He goes by AKA Cloudmaster Gabe. What's up, man? How you doing? What's up? Fucking burnt. <laughs> burnt? All right. All right. Um, before we get into it, I want to introduce uh, the other homies that are part of the show now. Uh, uh, Listo and uh, Peralta, they're the couch uh, boys. Yeah, long What's time, up? long yeah. time homies though. Fucking shout out to them. They're part of the show now. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, before let's go right into it. What city are you repping? Fucking West Covina. Fucking was it? I forgot which one of these fools was West Cove, but no, actually both of them are probably from West Cove, but they fucking moved around a lot. Okay, so you're representing area. West Cove. Is that where you grew up, or is that where you live now? Oh, is it? No, actually, I've lived there yeah, pretty much most of my life, but okay. again, we got to get into it later on. But. All right, all right. And how did you start uh, skateboarding? Uh, fuck. And they also know this story, too, because they know the fool that got me, got me started on skating. Because um, my cousin, Bada, a.k.a. Omar, started, okay. started skating because he used to live with us. Mm-hmm. All right. For, fuck, I'm trying to think. Was it because he lived with us and he just randomly saw a bus and Ollie somewhere? But I'm trying to think exactly what it was. Uh, nice. It was like saw him Ollie and then do a bunch of shit. But, okay. Okay. And then I think I've remembered seeing a couple of videos randomly, but it's like in fragments. All right. All right. Uh, so Bato was the first one that you saw skateboarding. And then did you ride his board the first time or? I, did you get a board right away? I think we had a board in my house, but because it was a, uh, but it was just lying around somewhere. It was like a random. I don't know if it was a swap meet or a target board, but for some okay. reason that shit, it was made of actual wood. Okay. <laughs> it wasn't the fucking particle boards that you find at Walmart now. Right, right, right. So it was a decent one. Yeah, it was a pretty decent one for the time. Okay. Uh, and are you regular or goofy footed? Uh, goofy. Goofy footed. All right. All right. Uh, you remember your first trick that you landed that hyped you up? It's fuck. Honestly, I don't remember the two. Well, no, no. But okay. I can remember it was it, but I can tell you it was it. My first trick I was psyched on was learning hard flips for the first time. Hard flips. Which I think I was about seventeen. When okay. I think that's when you probably picked up the name the hard flip master. Okay. Yeah, because it's fucking. That was like the one trick that I fucking stuck with because that was the one trick that i made sure like i had locked it locked down because fucking yeah, i couldn't fucking a lot of curses in shit. this episode <laughs> yeah try to kick back on the cursing because <laughs> you know youtube i don't know how they are with the yeah. you yeah. know with they, the algorithm yeah we might we don't get a strike in the first five minutes of the show oh, it's all good it's all good i don't know how the nine club got away with it <laughs> uh i don't know if they do really um let's see here i'm sure there's a certain amount but yeah, yeah, they they allow you a little bit. I think you have to pass like the first ten minutes, and yeah. then then they then they don't really mind. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, what would be your favorite trick? Would that be the hard flip? Yeah, pretty much any variation of a hard flip. Any variation? Yeah. Damn, that's cool, man. So, fakey hard flips, switch hard flip. Fakey switch, nollie, regular. Okay. Uh, what else? Oh, was it Ghetto Bird? Fucking the dig. Oh shit. That's all good. It's all good. Yeah. Was it the dig on that head up, which is basically, or basically was it? It's basically Seva's trick. Was it hard mm-hmm. foot front reaver? But mm-hmm. he didn't switch. That's cool. <laughs> That's cool. Dude. Anything like that? If I have right. his, dude. If I can get Diego on head on here, that'd be, that'd be a field day. <laughs> <laughs> all dude, right. All right. And that uh, sick. <laughs> what's your what's a what's the biggest thing? Maybe you threw a hard flip down. I'm trying to think. Do you go down? Do you do stair sets? Do you huck or anything? I'm, try, I'm trying to. <laughs> trying to? Okay. All right. All right. But it's, I know the craziest one that the one that shouldn't work, but it did. Okay. I was the away. Day, it was the away days Chief Keep concert. Okay. And ended up going to. What was it? Ended up going to some club in LA, and they had like a four stair in the front. <laughs> Four stair? I know, four stair in the back. Okay. And everyone was smoking joints and drinking. And right. And you busted one out there? Yeah, it took me a long time, but I did it. But I was super, 
Basically, I was super drunk, and then was it, I think, T Funk or someone threw me a spliff. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, yeah. And Cameron Bradley was there, but was it I ended up getting the worst photo ever? Like, I took a photo, photo of him, and he was super, it was super blurry. Uh, okay, all right, because I was right. so drunk. Uh oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You gotta be careful out there skating like that, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah, Look what some, happened to me. Yeah, but somehow, <laughs> yeah, somehow that joint ended up mellow, mellowing me out and ended up. Getting sober and sober enough to drive home. That oh, night. Okay, okay. Well, be careful out there. We don't. Yeah, I definitely. We don't condone that out there, but yeah, it's I all good. Have, don't worry. I quit drinking like a long time. No, oh, that's good. So. That's good. Which, it, that's a yeah, that's another story. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, is there a trick that you out there that you want to learn still? <sighs> I wanted to learn, pretty much learn it all. Learn it all, right? Right. Anything right now that's kind of getting away from you that you've been trying lately? Oh well, yeah, was it? Because I'm, well, yeah, definitely stagnant because I just came from work. Okay, okay, okay. Because I pretty much got off work and and then just lined this up last minute. <laughs> right, 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 right. Last minute. Last minute. All right. Well, how about uh your board setup? What's your oh, board wait. setup? Oh wait, I haven't um. Oh wait, but I haven't answered the first question. Okay, go for it. Uh, it was what was it? I forget what I was trying. Oh, was it? It was hard to flip down. Oh no, it wasn't. Didn't really get away, but it was supposed to, or I was supposed to get to it. It was hard flip off of Bassett. Okay. What was the ten? ten? Yeah, Bassett ten. Or no, actually, probably Nolly hard off Bassett ten because that was someone from the shop fucking pointed to that out. Ah, uh, uh, oh well. Okay. If we're keeping that in, or whatever, <laughs> or someone can censor that, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he doesn't want anybody to do it before him. Is that the case? Uh, yeah. All right. Either right. Nolly or Switch. I don't, all right. Well, one. well, I have to. This episode, have to get the you got a week or two before this episode drops, so you got some time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you could have said you could have said that earlier. I could have just gone off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, what about a board setup? What's your board setup right now? Actually, my board's right there. I can <laughs> bring if someone can bring it over there. Was it? Uh, but sh- you want to? Hey, if it anything, down. show show the audience. <laughs> okay. I'm sure, they all know. Hold on. Which pretty much was it? Does it changed over the years? Was it? But right now, was it? Pretty much eight five. I think this was. Was it? Just a random anime deck that I found that sent it off the, sent off the pro graphic and covered the lo- covered the logo on this. Okay. Um. Was it? But it's eight and a half. And need a longer tail. But, and if Rick and Mike see this, please make that twin paddle shape in a four fourteen point five inch wheelbase. Mm. I'll skate that forever. <laughs> but. Yeah, but anyway, it's pretty much eight and a half, um, whatever shape that I can get. Right. Um, Thunder one forty nines. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, the home. Oh, yeah, the hubby Joey Coleman, who works at Talk Hardware in Grizzly. Okay. And some other companies. Was it? He blessed it with his Talk Hardware, and that's all I rep now. Rock now. Um, what was it Spitfire Wheels fifty six? Okay. Uh, SKF bearings, and these ones are actually really good because these just came out. All right. Like a big about a year or two ago, uh, which Cater and I shot approved. So, yeah, right. if anyone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good, good and shit. pretty much whatever grip, Mob, Jessup. Okay. All right. All right. And uh, maybe Shake, but I used to skate Shake John a lot back in the day, because that honestly that grip was like that perfect middle ground between Jessup and uh, Mob. Okay. Which and if Mo- and if they see this, please put that in the shops. All right. Yeah. You will have my money guaranteed for the rest of <laughs> the rest of my life. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. All right. Uh, what would be a local skate park? Local skate park. Oh yeah, they mean these fools, no? <laughs> Wesco. Yeah, Wesco. Wesco. Yeah, we, we were locals there for freaking years. For so many years, yeah, dude. How long do you think you've been skating there for? Since uh... let's see, I mean, I first found it at eighteen. Okay. And we'd always go there when I think when the college years were hitting. So. Hmm. So pretty much, I was going there f- from the start of college up until pretty All right. much when COVID hit. So. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. But uh, yeah, dude, that's cool. What about a local skate park? I'm sorry, local skate shop. A local <laughs> skate shop. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I almost said the same question again. <laughs> local skate shop. Oh, uh, yeah, which... Also, another funny story about that was... Uh, I don't even... What was it? I think Lee... No, Lee's still in... 
and Peralta know about this, but or they knew about local shops back then, but I probably did it. Or, but um, pretty much it was <sighs> whatever shop I could find, and then I think Borders opened up. Borders. And then after that. I think I found Pond for the first time because I was so curious and wanted to find it. Okay. And then Active started, then Active opened up around, you know, I, was, I think when I was 19. Mm-hmm. And this dude, we had Lisa wrote for him. Oh, yeah. For Active yeah, West yeah. Active. Yeah. yeah, Active West Covina. Right. Mm-hmm. That's cool, man. Yeah. And then was it, and also the story with that was, was it <clears throat> kind of went back and forth between. I think when borders it active because was it sometimes they wouldn't active wouldn't have things that we would need, and that borders was pretty much the backup if you needed something. Right. And then what was it? But I think some time passed, and then, act because was it they switched owners so many times so they ended up uh, going out going out of business with right. some of their sh- or they ended up closing some of their shops down. Right, right. I remember that. Yeah, and then I think was it. And I think I was starting to get a job at Borders at the time because I almost died in a car accident. Oh wow! Well, that around that year, well, huh? what happened there? Oh yeah, that um, was it. Because it was Street League LA. I was supposed to be <clears throat> like right when we were finished wrapping up um, or cleaning up everything. We ended up going to or actually I ended up taking my friend home to to his house in LA because mm-hmm. it was on the way. But basically, I was driving normal speed, and then out of nowhere, some fucking red Jetta just sideswiped me, and then mm-hmm. I just flew into the sidewall wow. in the middle of the free, in the middle of the five, and and on top of which I hit my head, which that caused me a lot of caused me a lot of problems to this day. Like I have trouble sleeping. Wow. Still have a lot of a. Uh, yeah. Wow. How long was that? You said. That was. Yeah, that was right before COVID hit. Oh, right before COVID hit. 2019, so August. Wow. Damn, that's crazy. And anything happened with the, whoever sideswiped you? Do they know who it was? or? It was a Red Jetta. Yeah. And forever I have beef against Red Jettas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would too, man, for sure, man. I, yeah. would, I would not want to see one on the road after that. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yep. Yeah. Um, but I see you're wearing a pawn, pawn shop shirt. Oh, yeah. So, that so was... would that be your logo now? Uh, yeah, it was pretty much those two. Was it if was it, I think if Pawn usually doesn't have what I need, then mm-hmm. I kind of go between those two. But regardless, right? Because Anthony takes care of me so well, I try to do. I try to go there as much as possible. Yeah, that's cool. As long as you're supporting local shops, I mean, yeah, you spread a little love here and there. That's all good. Yeah, man. of course. Yeah, that's all good. That's all good. All right. Um, any dream sponsors to have, like possibly? <sighs> Let's see any companies that are symmetrical shapes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Which I think so far that would be real chocolate. Mm-hmm. Uh, Primitive should be coming out with one soon. So, all right. Well, those, those are those uh, double tail board. Yeah, know, the twin paddles. I know those are the ones you like too, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but yeah. was it? I think Primitive. Yeah, because Primitive is supposed to come out with a twin nose shape. Which, yeah. Oh yeah, and Primitive. If you're watching this. Make make that shape in a longer wheelbase <laughs> and an eight and a half. He I'm wants telling, that. He wants that wheelbase longer. I'm telling you, make me that, and I will buy shit off you immediately. Yeah. <laughs> shit off you immediately. All right, all right. Immediately. Um, do you listen to music while you're skateboarding, uh, or do you have the headphones in, or do you like to rock a, a bump the radio or anything? Depends where I'm at. Was depends it? where you're at. Which. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, again, I'm tired. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. He just came from work. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but, uh, Hard-working man, man. Yes, sir. Yeah, on uh, and off the board. Yeah. But anyways, uh, it was... Music? Uh, yeah, sometimes. Was It depends what I'm doing. Was it If it's at the skate park and there's homies around, I usually mm-hmm. don't have them in. Okay, yeah, I feel you. Because also, the homies are around. Right, right. You want to just hang out and oh, chill. I just want to dap them up. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> all um, right. Yeah, but we usually was it because I also work um flat bar Fridays over at a uh, Covina Park. Okay. Oh yeah, and that's also the reason why what was it because they took me in. They was, so I pretty much started working events for Pawn Shop after I, after I left Borders for three years. Okay. Or left Borders after working for them for three years, which it was there was no ill will. It was just right. I was burnt. Okay. 
<sighs> Sick of dealing with Karens down there. Okay, yeah, I can see that. I can see there. that. But you do, uh, what would you say, Flat Bar Fridays? Yeah, Flat Bar Fridays okay. and now else. Yeah, because pretty much I do that and also whatever whatever events that they throw mm-hmm. or we set up. And also I do staging for concert venues and whatnot. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Don't, you, you help out with the, with the Memo Local events too, don't you? Oh, yeah. Was it? Well, now I can. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they I have something was, coming up. I, know, I, was waiting I don't for know what this probably already is gonna drop after that event already happened. So it's yeah. no, I, I think no, I this drop, episode will drop uh, before it. I don't a, know. It's yeah. the 29th. Okay. So the, the next one comes out on the what 20? Oh no, yeah, it'll be it'll be past it. It'll be past. Yeah. yeah, something like that. Yeah, it's all good. Well, I think we had a good time. I I, I hope I was there for sure. <laughs> yeah, but, you know what I mean. <laughs> Shit. We'll, we'll I'm sure I'll be, be there. I'm sure I'll be refing, and maybe this time I might. Might skate, might skate in that contest okay. <laughs> while well, being the ref. Well, hopefully we see this and we know that it has happened and you know we, we, hey, everybody had a good you, time. Didn't you ref the ES game of skate? Oh uh, yeah, no, and, I um, already know that. You're gonna say that. Hey, wait, <laughs> You're no, gonna no, say no, I made no, some no. bad calls on that one. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, dude, it's no, so I'll hard. Just remember, I just Do you know how hard it is to freaking ref a game? Was it? I didn't even realize it until then because you have to freaking keep trying the letters while you're while you're freaking keeping track of someone's. Well, even then, Total too, you, you can't, whatnot. like, even though your friend's out there, you can't hold the favoritism. Right, though. right, right, of course. So, like, I know that makes it hard because, like, like, I want the homie to win, but, yeah, but Cheeto I got to be fair. Yeah, but Cheeto was the homie, though. <laughs> yeah, but you got to be fair at the same time, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's kind of hard to be rest. Yeah, I just if anything that was just me not paying it, me not paying attention, and also my ADD kicking in really bad. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely, I know, I know how that is. I, I have it myself, so sometimes I just. I just wander off. I'll be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see, I'm, see, I'm not the only one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, dang, that's cool. So, uh, refereeing some stuff that's that's pretty fun. Um, that kind of gets to a point where I'm like, what other hobbies do you have besides skateboarding? Like, I know you do a bunch of events and you like to go to a lot of a lot of uh, contests too, don't you? Uh, yeah. I know. If anything, that's how was it? it kind of got my name out there. Right. Same with me. I would show up to events and try to yeah, just. Yeah, because that's how we met. That's pretty much how we first met. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. We, I'm trying to think which event we met at. It was. Could have been a quite a few, man. Like, we, there's so many where we ran into all, and we would all run into each other. Yeah. yeah so many. <laughs> yeah, the skate world is kind of big, but small at the same time. Where yeah. if you're out there and people know who you are, then you know, the, yeah. and and they mess with you. You know, it's all good. Yeah. It's all fun out there, man. All right, all right. How about a dream spot to travel to? A dream spot? Yeah. Dude, there's way too many, dude. There's way too many. <laughs> <laughs> Just travel the world and skate everything? It's like, yeah, dude. <laughs> but one, there's like a couple spots, was it? Well, for, well, it's pretty much every single spot where it was it. There's also, was it, <clears throat> a homie or some lady... Or somebody that I can chat up with <laughs> over down there. Right, right, right. Yeah, of course. But one of them for sure is Japan. Japan? Oh, yeah, because yeah. oh yeah, not many people know who's it. Dream spot right there for me. Mm-hmm. Oh, for real? Oh, I would yeah. love to go to Japan, man. Wait, you do, wait. You also watch anime too, too or whatever? Yeah, yeah. You, you know we got, we so, talked it up. Oh yeah, Cowboy Bebop. Was yeah. <laughs> I I just went through the whole One Piece series right now. All right. Dude, that's like 500. <laughs> well, I stopped at season 13. Oh, season 13. Oh, okay. Yeah. Damn, my brother's still going. <laughs> Don't spoil it for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, I, haven't no even started, I haven't even started it. <laughs> All right. I'm really on uh, Monster, which was, um, I don't remember how many episodes that is. Oh, no, it's 75 or 6. All right. But that show is so trippy, dude. <laughs> If, mm-hmm. they, if anything, I'll just send you my list later. Yeah, yeah. Shoot it down. We'll, we'll, we'll link up and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll trade some anime. Yeah. The... Hell yeah, hell yeah. yeah. Um, how about a favorite pro or a favorite team? There's quite a lot. Okay. Again, fan of it all, but it was right. it top... I really you have to... say maybe top five? I know, I really have to give it some thought. Yeah, because that one was... Well, of course, everyone in Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Right. Skate. You did mention the the Reynolds right here, oh, yeah. the boss. Re- yeah, Reynolds. Oh, yeah. Let's, you did that. I don't even know if you did that on purpose. No, I didn't know. It just it just happened to be, you know, on, <laughs> just up happened. there. Yeah. Yeah, and that was... Oh, yeah, by the way, that's also how I started skating, too. That video game right there. The video the, game? In the background. That's <laughs> what's up. Yeah. I think that's, the, what, the first one? Yeah, Tony Hawk Pro Skater 1. Yeah, but yeah, it started so. on um, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4, so... 
I don't know why I had to say the whole damn title. <laughs> <laughs> that was like, hey, I heard myself say it. I go, wow, that's pretty crazy. Hey, you never know. There, there might be a younger generation that yeah. they don't even know about it. That's like, true. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's funny. Those kids, they might not even know. Yeah, that's I'm true. That's probably true. considered an old man to them. <laughs> yeah. Hey, well, that, that, that game changed a lot of lives, man. I sat yeah. on the couch a lot of hours playing that damn game. Back Especially when they came out with the part where you can keep, like, the manuals? The manuals? Oh, yeah. God. <laughs> it was over, bro. You could just hold the manual after the clock and keep we going. Had to, we had to kick oh, people off cheat. because <laughs> that was just, they would, couldn't yeah. stop. Oh, no, that's the cheat going. code where we can yeah. add unlimited manuals. Yeah, the yeah. time would run out, but you can just keep going. Trick, combo, Trick, combo, combo, combo. combo. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. You're like, I wow. Know. Yeah, that, yeah was, but, that was good times. It was good times. I know. Oh, yeah, but anyways, but that's also one of my favorite pros, Andrew mm-hmm. Reynolds. Um yeah, pretty much anyone in that video game, but mm-hmm. Andrew Holmes was definitely one of the top five for sure. Okay. Let's see. How about a team? Whole team. Let's see, Chris. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah, Chris Cole was okay. another one. What was it? He's got some good stuff. You know what? The whole pawn crew is fucking. Those dudes, they hold it down for me. Hell oh, yeah. Shout out. Yeah. Shout out to them, man. No, they, they do have a gnarly team, man. I know. Yeah. I, I Especially Donovan. Oh, yeah. And yeah. also, FYI, Donovan's having a kid soon, so. Hey, shout out. Congrats. If you see, if you see, if you see his Instagram, please text him congrats mm-hmm. on being a dad. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, man. Congrats. I got a yeah. question. Yeah, yeah. so. <laughs> what about uh, homie favorite skaters? Homie favorite? Oh, yeah. My boy Lee still right here. Lee right here. You're official. <laughs> You're official for that answer, weren't you? <laughs> And basically, uh, you and Brooks. Nah. We're going to edit that out. Yeah, you and Brooks. Nah. <laughs> I don't know if you want. I might, I might have to put a little sound effect over that uh, one. <laughs> yeah. So, Brooks. It's going to be like Kill Bill, where they don't say her name in the oh. first two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That'd be great. Thank you, thank you. Yes, sir. All right, all right. Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah. Um. Any any local skaters you would want to see on the show? Oh, was it? I for, oh yeah, I forgot to. But I forgot to mention. The, oh, go for it. The stuff was it? It was. Look at me. Riddles, Cole. Oh, was it Donovan, Listo? Okay. And let's see, Miles was it? Miles Silvis for mm-hmm. sure. All right. Because he's the main reason why we're Adidas now. So. Okay. Okay. That's Which a, that's, that's a good thing, question. That's too. the thing I get from the other skate shop. Is some Adidas, shoes is Adidas mainly? That's cool. That's Everything cool. else I mainly try to get from pawn shops. So. Would that be your favorite skate shoe right now? The skate, which uh, yeah, pretty much any was it. Honestly, was it the one of my favorite shoes to skate was was it, it was the tie. Sh- it's like a couple. No, it was like top few or whatever. Who is it? I'll, I'll just list them off right now. Mm-hmm. It's the tie shons, which luckily those are still out. Both low and regular. Um, was it the forum ADVs? Okay. Because those are real sturdy. And oh, yeah, and that was also the thing, too. I like breaking my shoes in and skiing them for a long time. That's cool. Because I hate breaking new stuff. Right. Um, was it these Sheltos? Was it the Sheltos? The Superstars were pro models. Um, what else? Oh, was it the um, 3STs? Pretty much every every single one. All right. Well, Which, yeah, Adidas, if you're hearing this, bring all four of those back. <laughs> <laughs> more shoes, al- more shoes. Yeah, and also, who is it? The Dorado ADV Boost. Okay. And also, was it the only thing that they need to improve on that shoe? Because, was it that whole shoe was perfect, but... The only thing they need to do is just probably just extend the boost foam a bit towards the, the balls of your feet. Okay. Because that was also the thing, too, was it? Because sometimes when you would land with some impact, you would always hit that ball of your foot mm. on the ground because that part would kind of thin out a bit. Oh, and that was also the other issue was the kind of the tread at the bottom. Sometimes it would wear out a bit quicker than those. quicker. Than okay. Those. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, damn, if any shoe companies are out there, Gee, hire the homie Gabe. He I knows know, what he's yeah. talking he about. Talking yes. About <laughs> If anything, I can review shoes for you. <laughs> and I can test out shoes for you. Yes, yes. Shout out, shout out. Yeah. All right. Um, how about oh, we yeah, do? We're doing good, good, we're, good, we're, good we're, on time, we're, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, what was it? But we, oh, yeah, what was the other question that, um, was it? Don't, oh, yeah, also, was it favorite team? That's, was it? Mm-hmm. Honestly, quite a lot, was it? But right now, it'd have to be, was it? Primitive and, uh. Primitive is killing it. Yeah, no. Primitive, April, and hockey. Ooh. Yeah. All good teams. Mm-hmm. So good teams would be key favorites, man. Yeah. Hell yeah. Shout out to them. Yeah. All right. Um. Anything else before we start getting out of here? Yeah, but wasn't there, Um. was it 
Wasn't there also supposed to be a... I forgot to mention Hot... We missed a bunch of stuff, actually. There was... <sighs> some hobbies or whatever. Yeah, oh, we got you with the hobbies. Yeah, we got you with the hobbies, but do you have any other hobbies that you want to share? Let's see. Oh, yeah, was it? Because I never even mentioned it. It was... Was it actually produce music on the... Was it? Yeah, I also produce music and do mixing and mastery and stuff like that. Oh, sick. Mm. That's right. I forgot to bring it up because he was one of the dudes I was talking to about the soundboard when I first got it. Okay. All right. Because yeah, that was... I could have been the sound guy for the... <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. Right. He, he, he helped a lot. All right. Me do you the put? Right do you, you? So you're producing? You said music or something. Yeah, that? producing music. I've, anything it, out there? Like I, on I reco- on it, SoundCloud or anything like to that? Think, was it? Because I recorded um, two. I think I recorded two artists. No, wait. You know, it was two artists. Yeah, I was work, recorded with two artists and then kind of mixed and mastered for another artist who mm-hmm. was it? But all those. All of those artists were pretty close to me, so was it? That's cool. Two of those were old friends of mine, and then one of them I met on, I think I just randomly met on Instagram, and then kind of paid it off. Not a collab? Yeah, pretty much. And was it? And the funny thing about that was that I ended up producing her whole entire record for oh, wow. the artist, because she was up in Wisconsin. Okay. Producing a whole record. Wow. Is, that's out and everything? Yeah, that was out already. All right. Do you know what the name of it is? Uh, what was it? It was Come to Terms. Uh, I, forget, I think it was Sophia Lena. Okay. Okay. Shit. That's cool. But, I have um, to check that out. You want yeah. to Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hard flips and producing music. That's what's up. Yeah. Hell yeah. Pretty much the muska. <laughs> the muska here. Oh, shit. Yeah, because you, yeah. you did that back then. Yes, yeah, sir. We're going to have to start calling you Young Muska. Young Muska. Young Muska. <laughs> yeah. Cloud even, Muska Gabe. Yeah, but I don't even dress like him. We're wearing the old TSAs. <laughs> yeah. Well, he does have a, a, a unique style, that's for sure. We just yeah. got to give him a boombox and have him land mm-hmm. the hard with that boombox. Well, there you go. <laughs> Put his pant Dude, leg up. he's so heavy. <laughs> you know? Old fashioned style. It's all style. good. It's all good. It's all good. All right. Um, Pretty much the mind of Reynolds and Steve's a musket. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Anything else before we get out of here? Uh, Any shout outs? What was it? I think I might have said it all, but I don't even remember. Who was it? <sighs> He's tired <laughs> over tired there. To yeah. <laughs> yeah, too tired to remember. No, I, know, I know how it is working those graveyard shifts, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It, was, it was so many great. Trust me, I worked so many graveyard shifts coming up. It was, it was brutal. All right. They definitely uh. That's it. I definitely should have uh, tried to have um. <clears throat> gonna have like another side. What was it? Not another side show, but um. An energy drink. <laughs> <laughs> well, that too. But yeah. Was it? Yeah. No, but basically have another show or was it? You kind of just sit around and just kind of chat it up, chat it up with the homies over. Uh. It's all good. It's all good. Kind of like the nightclub experience. Uh, well, they're no longer a show anymore, unfortunately, the nightclub experience. But you still can watch the nightclub. They're still around. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, if anything, golden opportunity for you. Hey, so, well, well you that's what we're, hey, we're trying to just get local skaters in here. Uh, every so often, we may have a pro in here. You never know. Yeah. So uh, we've had one so far. Yeah, so because I saw a Jimmy Ray on there. So. Yes, sir. And so uh, yeah. So maybe in the future we'll have a couple more, but those will be like special guest kind of things. And that was and that was one thing that I've always wanted to do. Was I always wanted to meet Jimmy Ray. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. And also, and that was also one thing too, because he skate. Because also, I live right by the water tower that he ollied. Right. That's no longer available either. They put a, a poles around it. Did, was that you that sent yep. me the picture of that? Poles? Yep. Yep. Wait. They put a railing around it now, so you can't do anything anymore. Oh, okay. Railing around. Wait. I just on, I just on, passed by it on Easter. On the roof of the water tower. Yep. There's railing now, so you can't even. Uh, can't unless no, you go. No more. Unless go, somebody uh, cuts it off. You yeah, know but, what I mean? But yeah, but not many people are going up there. <laughs> somebody must have maybe went up there and done something for them to put a rail up. Yeah, That's what and, I'm thinking. Uh, they probably deal with like bikers or somebody just even jumping the fence trying to get just, in there. Yeah, but, then, but honestly, whoever, nah, if, if anything was it, you have to be super, super gnarly in order to get that. Right. Which, oh, for sure. For uh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, you have to defy gravity. Um, yeah. Or look like Nick. Or basically have the physique of Nick Dopp here to push yourself over that. 
There you go, man. All right, shout outs before we get out of here, man. Okay, was it? Um, <clears throat> it should be pretty much Pawn Shop Skate Co. Um, shout out. What was it? Joey Coleman. Oh, what was it? Emil Murray. I <laughs> totally forgot about that dude. He's tight. Works at New, works at New Balance, April. Mm-hmm. Uh, what other companies does he work for? Was it? Oh, Cortina Bearings. Um, and out. some other ones, but was it? But yeah, was it? Basically, Joey Coleman, Emil Murray. Was it? Pawn Shop. Yeah, fuck it. That's the Fortis Crooper helped me out at a tough spot. Yes, sir. Shout out. And pretty much anyone that's helped me out over the years. Everybody out there that's helped them out, shout out to them. Um, I want to thank you for coming down, sharing your story with us, buddy. Dude, yeah. it's good times, always. Yeah. Actually, um, I have, actually, I have plenty more stories that we never yeah, covered well, here. Maybe but. we could do another episode, you know. We, you know, we'll do a part two. Yeah, we got to do a part two for you sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, but uh, I want to thank everybody for tuning in. I want to thank uh, my guests for coming down. I want to thank everybody for watching the yeah. show. Hit that like. Make sure to subscribe to our channel. Hit that all notification bell so you know when we're dropping our episodes. Uh, I got to thank my couch boys in the house. Oh, yep. Shout out to Lisa and Peralta holding it down, you know, working the ones and twos. Uh, make sure to uh, share this out. Tell a friend. And uh, if you have a friend or you want to be on the show, let us know in the comments. Until next time, peace.